Eight, or search HSN card at hsn.com. Simply classic. Simply essential. Simply perfect for every style. Sometimes the greatest pleasures are the simplest ones of all. Watch Concierge Collection tonight only on HSN. Welcome to the kitchen. So we had a couple of hours of electronics, and now we're going to uh, treat you to some great products um, in our kitchen. And by the way, our testimonial line is going to be open. I know that 150,000 of the master dicers, which we're going to start you with in this hour, have been sold. I worked in the restaurant business for about 18, 19 years, okay? And I will tell you, it takes a long time to get to learn how to use a knife. Knife skills are very, very important. Some of us never learn them. If you have the master dicer, <laughs> it makes life so much easier because you're going to get consistent chopping and dicing and slicing. So easy, never been easier in your life. In fact, uh, this, uh, I went online before the show, over 800 perfect five-star reviews on this wow. product. And of course, the wonderfully talented John Florell, who I know, know knows how to use a knife. <laughs> He's yeah. a fisherman, a sportsman, knows how to use it. But it sure is nice to let the machine do the work. I know, I, I, listen, <laughs> I am not a chef, okay? Right. Yeah, but I love to cook, and when you cook, I mean, this, like, like I said, this is like having your own little sous chef, yeah, okay? It, it yeah. does the work for you. I've got a half an onion that I placed on top of the machine. Watch what happens. See, all you do is press down on the lid and the blades inside do the work <laughs> for you. So you can mince an onion. Here's a whole onion minced in what? Less than five seconds. Awesome. Okay? Awesome. I mean, how much time does it save you? But also, it does a perfect job. So, I mean, in a matter of seconds here, if you've got maybe a soup, a stew, or maybe it's time for chili or taco night, you want to mince up a whole bunch of onions, backyard yeah. barbecued hamburgers. Look at this. I just did a whole bowl. Everything goes into the bowl. Here, I'll put this out on the tray in the front. That way, you guys at home can see Whoa. the consistency that you get Look with the master that. dicer. <laughs> I mean, every piece is exactly the same. So you get perfect minced onion in seconds. Now, any one of the toughest things to dice uh, in the kitchen, it's got to be leeks. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. But they go great for soups and stews and salads. Take your leeks, place it on top, and press. And instantly, wow. it's like having 24 little knives that all work at the same time to mince your leeks, mince your onions, mince anything that grows in layers, like cabbage, celery, sure. onions, leeks. Anything that grows in rings or layers will automatically mince when it goes through those blades. And I mean, I'm talking, Gosh, you can do bowls full in seconds, okay? I mean, and you get a it would take a chef for five, yeah. 10 minutes to chop like that. And the consistency Look is perfect each and every time. And that's why you're gonna love the Master Dicer. Now, there's three different blades for this, okay? You've got the one with the small holes, just like this one. That's the one I've done the mincing on. You also have one with larger holes, so if you want bigger pieces, you would pick this one. Or you can do your slicing with the slicing insert, and I'll show you that one in a second, but I gotta tell you, it doesn't matter what you wanna do with this machine. It all, you can do every, just about everything but the cooking with it. Right. But different vegetables grow different ways, all right? Mm -hmm. So onions, cabbage, celery, anything in layers will mince. Watch what happens with something solid, like a carrot. When I push it through, you get carrot sticks, so it'll julienne. Right. So and anything you're just solid. standing it up on a little angle yep. and just popping it through. Now, I am gonna mention you put these in on an angle like this because it's kind of like an alligator that closes its mouth like this. Okay? Right, yes. So you tip it in on an angle and push it through, and, I'll, and the tip is this. If you stand this straight up and down like this and try and do this, what's gonna happen? It's gonna roll off this way, right? Right. Now, you can mince them this way, or you can make sticks really short, or use the length of the vegetable to get longer carrot sticks, Looking longer pota potato french fries longer zucchini spears for a vegetable tray. Now, oh, speaking of french fries, instead of putting a, a, a carrot through the machine, use a potato. Place a potato on top and press. Instant shoestring french fries for the kids. You can do a zucchini and carrot sticks the same way. But I tell you what, instead of going to those fast food places, the last time I went to one, I looked at the price of, of a shoestring french fries. Sure. 95 cents for a four ounce package of french fries yeah. at those fast food places. Oh That's $4 a pound for potatoes. Yeah. Yeah, okay. you, you just, I just did four <laughs> potatoes in this machine. Exactly. It costs less than a dollar. I was just going to say, you know, <laughs> you a got bag, a bowl of, full. A bag of 
French fries cost you <laughs> yeah, five bucks. Yeah. This is probably a dollar and for it's a bag fresh. and a half. And look at that. Wow. And it's fresh. That would fill up a, a whole deep fryer right there. Now, if you want bigger French fries, here's how you change the machine. Right here on the top, there's a little tab that you pull back. You take this insert out. And by the way, these are easy to clean. You rinse them like a knife. It does come with a little cleaning brush. So that gets in between. It'll clean out all any anything that gets stuck in the blades. It'll clean it out. Plus, it also up here on the top helps clean this little pusher. So yeah. Kitchen Master has thought of everything. And let, I'll show you this. I, let me get to this one real quick because I love big French fries. Bigger carrot sticks. Big zucchini spears for a vegetable tray. You can see the difference immediately between the big French fries and the little French fries depending on the size of the blade that you're using. But I love this because the bowl catches everything. And if you, uh, here's a little tip. After you make your French fries, put a little cold water in here. Snap the lid on top of the bowl. That, by the way, this comes with it, okay? You mm -hmm. get the lid with it. That cold water will soak the starch out of those potatoes so they don't turn brown. Like, you know when you cut a potato, it turns brown? Sure. But, well, that's the starch in the potatoes. If you snap the bowl on there with some water, you can keep that in the fridge ready to go for the evening when you're ready to make the French fries. Yeah. So that's a little tip from my kitchen to yours. But here's something, too. This is the only machine that I've ever found that'll actually dice a red ripe tomato. Yeah. Hey, on taco night, you're gonna love this. Take a half a tomato, just cut a tomato in half, place it on top of that grate and press. Look at this. I mean, <laughs> how long does it take you to dice tomatoes now at home with a knife on taco night? Yeah. Or for fresh bruschetta, or for salsa, homemade, sure. thick and, and chunky can, salsa. You can make it all and, in this container. Yeah, it all goes right into the yeah. bowl and the, exact, the pieces of, uh, of uh, tomato are all exactly the same. Now, if you wanna add some onion to this, maybe you wanna make a thick and chunky salsa, or here, I'll make a a quick Greek salad. How's that? Oh, uh, yeah. Place a couple yeah. of onions on top. We'll change, oh, by the way, here. We'll change out this blade. You pop this out of here. We'll put the slicing blade in because for a Greek salad, you have a little bit of cucumber goes a long ways, right? right? Slice Place it up. on top. Now you got your sliced cucumber going into the salad. Now all you do is throw some olives in there, a little bit of feta cheese and some uh, some uh, 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 dressing. Snap yeah. the lid on yeah, top. Let me show everybody. That, though. Look at how perfect. <laughs> I know. Look at how perfect, perfect these cucumbers slices. are. You yeah. snap the lid on top like this. Look it. Take Give it a work. shake. You got yeah. your Greek salad ready to go. Let I me mean, tell everybody the easy. colors that we have available really quick, John. I'll step up front here. So it comes in this great green. It comes in purple. It comes in black. It comes in white. I know. It also the, comes in black. All the colors of the rainbow. Or, uh, <laughs> uh, I said black turquoise color. Yep. Uh, and by the way, white, there's only about 500. And then it comes in this orange color as well. And then, of course, red. Yeah. When you order, you get three sets of blades, so you can do any kind of the chopping that John's doing. But when you notice with John, uh, you know, listen, th th there's no real skill level you no. need to have to <laughs> use this other than the push. Yep. That's pretty all much you all you need to have. push down the lid, yep. and it, the blades do the work. Now, these are razor-sharp German stainless steel blades. If you have a bartender in your life, all right, you, they will you get one of these to a bartender as a gift. They love it just for the prep work that you can do with this. Look at that. I mean, perfect slices right through the seeds. Look, there's not even a seed out of place. Perfect for rimming glasses or for making your sangria. Or here, here's a tip too. Instead of slicing them lengthwise like that, if you take a knife and cut your fruit in half first, okay, mm -hmm. then place it on top, now you'll get those you, yeah. The little wedges. The okay, hard work. That, yeah, the hard work the machine does. Yeah, yeah. Look at this. Perfect for infusing. Bartenders if take you, hours to do that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you, they sit there for hours ahead of time for it to prep. Now you can do it quick and easy with the machine. By the way, yeah. you, uh, washing it, you can rinse it under the sink. You yep. can put it in the dishwasher, whatever you need to do. They it's clean so up simple. so easily. But the cool part about this too, Guy, is if you have bad knife skills, or maybe you're not comfortable with a knife, sure. your fingers never get close to these blades because the lid is what's doing all the work. I mean, so that's was pushing it through and look at this I mean how about sauteed mushrooms for a salad or for, for uh, sauteed mushrooms for a steak or sliced mushrooms for a salad I mean that quick and easy uh, you know even for an omelet in the morning yeah well, how quick and easy is that you know and John you gotta, each slice is perfect so they're all gonna yeah. saute up at the same time the smaller items are often the hardest to cut with a knife yes. too because yes. like radishes you ever try, try cutting a radish oh, with a knife very I dangerous know. you can hurt your fingers let's go to the phones we'll say hi to Carla Carla's in New York, and she wants to tell us about how much she loves hey, Carla. her kitchen master. Hi, Carla. Hi. Hello, Hi. darling. <laughs> Hi. I just love this machine. You got no idea. <laughs> tell I us. I this quite a while ago. Uh -huh. It's great. What it do you use it for? Me. Oh, my God. I love hash browns, so uh, I buy a bag of onions okay. and some potatoes and even peppers. Yes. I dice them all up, 
I freeze them like that. So in the morning, you just take and throw it in the pan. Oh, it perfect. has saved me steps and time. You have no idea. You know it's what? It's great I, for anything and everything. Right. You know what, Carla, I love too, is it keeps the mess all under one roof. You know what I mean? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I just put them in a freezer bag and I thought, you know, oh. nothing goes spoiled, you yeah. know, because you can do that. So and smart. It's great for pies. You can slice your apples. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, it's fabulous. And uh. the peeler I love too that came oh, with it. Oh, right. yeah. You know, I'm glad you mentioned that because that peeler, sometimes I forget to show it, but I you know. actually get it with the machine. <laughs> uh, Is that the, not the coolest peeler? It's the greatest peeler because when I want to make, um, I'm part Greek, so when I make my tzitzaniki sauce, which is with yeah. the yogurt, right. Ooh, I yeah. don't want the seeds of the cucumbers. So I just shred it. All the way and down. I stop right there where the seeds are, and I eat yeah. the, the core, but I have that okay. for my... Right. I love it. I yeah. tell you, I'm happy, very happy. Thank I'm so you glad so you brought much. that up because now I'm going to do the same thing because I love that <laughs> stuff. Uh, Carla, thank, thank you. you so much. You're wonderful. Appreciate your oh, comments. Thank you. Thank Thanks, you Carla. Thank you for bringing this. You, thank you. Have a nice day. You too, right, Take care. So, yeah, so the peel, this, this magic peeler comes that, along I with gotta it. I've got to tell yeah. you, you, I'm looking at the flex pay on this today. I it's mean, crazy. It's <laughs> normally two flex. It's $9. You would spend more than that on just the peeler. And you you're would. getting this. Look, it peels in both directions, so it's twice as fast as any other peeler for potatoes, carrots, apples, pears, kiwi fruit you know anything you want to peel but it's a dual-sided peeler so one side gives you a straight peel like you just saw me do this zucchini earlier maybe you're into zucchini pastas when you flip this over it's got a julienne peeler it gives you a long angel hair julienne awesome. cut oh for God. zucchini pastas uh, you're gonna love this if you like uh, for garnishing salads hey you do this with carrots for garnishing salads like this look at that you get that long angel hair cut if you're into stir fries hey you don't even need a walk to do stir fries stir Stir fries are quick and easy to cook, they're, and they're, they're healthy, they're good for you. And now with this little peeler, they're quick and easy to cut. I mean, you can imagine garnishing a salad with the... John, look at <laughs> no. that. It's awesome. This little peeler, I mean, I... It's worth it for this. No carbs. No <laughs> yeah. carbs in here. You, you do and you this. get that with the machine. Oh my and gosh. you know the coolest thing, guy? Here, yeah. pick that one up over there, okay? This, uh, this is That's how, it stores. This is how yeah. it stores, okay? Everything fits inside the container. All the blades, the peelers in there, the cleaning brush is in there, the lid snaps on the bottom, and that's all the room it takes up in the kitchen. You know what I bought? Look at everything that it you does. You know I bought one? Egg salad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Chopping yeah. eggs <laughs> and trying to mash eggs with a fork. I'm Absolutely. like, it is a freaking nightmare. Egg salad is, if you love a great there. egg salad, you are going to absolutely love this and machine. And watch this. You just used it for eggs. Watch. I like to hold this up so you the can best. see how those blades work. Oh. It separates the food as it goes through. All you do is press on the lid. The blades I do the it. work. That's and the for best. chopping up eggs for egg salad or for tuna fish, maybe you want to add some to a, a, like a southern style potato oh, salad. Perfect. Instead of trying to chop it with a knife where the, you know, the egg sticks to the knife blade and they tear yeah. apart in pieces. Yep. Or if you've ever tried to smash them with a fork. I mean, well, yeah. look at this. You get perfect pieces. And you could do the pickles in there. Oh, yeah. You could do and everything, everything comes out the want. same size. And then add some mayonnaise and some mustard yeah. in your good day. I mean, it's literally <laughs> even fresh herbs. You can do all that stuff inside there because we give you three separate blades. Yeah. Listen, I know not all of you can be five-star chefs, and not only but it can be like of our wonderful, talented kitchen folks here who learn how to use knives. But what's nice about this is you just cut the big pieces down into yep. smaller pieces, and you put them in the machine. Even things that have skin, like yeah. peppers and tomatoes, right? Yeah. And you right? don't have to be exact and precise. You just place it on the blade and the and the machine does the work for you. If you get some that spill out off to the side, you just push them over the top and push them through. I mean, this machine does way more work than those electric expensive machines, you know, those big food processing machines. You drop, listen, those blades that spin in the bottom of a barrel or a bowl, you drop something like this in there and hit the button, you end up with soup. But with this machine, because of the design of that blade, all you do is press. Besides, who wants to drag out a heavy food processor just to chop up some oh bell, bell peppers yeah, for, your, clean it. for your salsas <laughs> or for salads. I mean, look at the consistency. Every piece is exactly like the last. There's not a hump, a lump, a bump, or a chunk. Couldn't it comes out perfect. I know, there's no way you can do that by hand We have the knife. best chefs on the planet. Yeah. They'd be hard-pressed to do consistency <laughs> like that. I know. Uh, or they'd get somebody else to <laughs> yeah, do I mean, and, and you know what? A lot of great chefs use these machines. Yes, I know. And yeah. it, it's because of the consistency. And the variety of things that you can do with this machine are literally endless. It depends on the vegetables that you have. Now, obviously, you're not going to, you know, make carrots or, or sticks out of something with a pit. So if it's like right. an avocado, sure. you know, you want to take the pit take out the before pit you out. put it on there. But, but avocados but, are a pain to cut. 
oh, consistently, yeah. right? Oh, and again, everything goes into the bowl. You can use it as a service bowl if you want. If you want to serve sure. right in the bowl, make your salad, serve it right in the same bowl. Yeah. I mean, talk about saving time. Talk about saving money. And look at this. It does again. I'm going to I'm going to change this out. If you you don't have to use the machine for everything that we're showing you here today, but guy, if you use this machine for one or two things, if even if you just pull it out for taco night, wouldn't it be worth it just for taco night to chop or dice your tomatoes like this? You know what I? Or, and you get the onions that dice the exact same consistency. I, the other thing I use it for outside of egg salad yes. is I love, especially in the summer, I love gazpacho. Oh, yeah. And gazpacho, you have to chop all your vegetables. And I like mine small. I don't like them pulverized like right. a food processor. And you can do everything in there. The oh, cucumber, yeah. the onion, the tomatoes, yep. the peppers, everything yeah. you put in there. And then you simply put it in a big bowl and add tomato juice. I mean, yeah. and, oh, and, yeah. you, and you're there. You can put the lime, lime juice, lemon juice. It's phenomenal. All right. Yep. We got about two minutes left. And we always get yep. crazy busy. Remember, 800 perfect five-star reviews on this product. You heard our caller calls in yep. and they're like, oh my gosh, to make my Greek salads, to make my Greek yogurt right. dressings. It, I mean, it goes on and on. And, and it doesn't matter whether it's a fruit or a veg. Yep. You can put meat in there if you want. Cheeses, doesn't That's it. matter. Yeah, you, all you do is push it through. Make cheese and ham straws for a chef's yeah. salad. I mean, anything solid with the blades with the holes in them like this come out in a stick. Anything that grows in layers like cabbage, celery, or onions, when you push down on the top like that, it separates them into perfect pieces. Now, we just sliced up a whole bunch of lemon and lime, okay? Uh, if, if, like, like I said, I gave one to my bartender. I don't even have to pay for drinks anymore. No. It just saves them that much time. All set, but, John. Yeah, I know. But look Go at this. I mean, the, he go, John goes in with his little chopper and he yeah. cuts the limes for the bartender <laughs> it's like, and he gets free drinks. Yeah. Hey, I got all the what tricks. The Listen, heck, John? <laughs> even for making carrot sticks like this, okay? Uh -huh. I love this machine, too, because Kitchen Master's thought of everything. Let me lift this up to show you. Up here, okay, you'll notice there's two little tabs here. They are not tabs, but these are like silicone legs. When you set this down on your countertop or tabletop, it keeps it from going from sliding back and forth. So you, you, everything, you know, it's you know, stable. It's and uniform, I'll tell you something. And Kat, you guys in the kitchen can agree. Aren't, aren't yeah. carrot sticks really hard? They're hard for everybody. Yeah, even apple cut, sticks, right? Yeah. Even professional yeah. chefs, they're hard to cut because, especially a carrot, it's a really hard vegetable. Yeah. It rolls and all that stuff. Do it in there. Look at that. Yeah, apple sticks. Man. Apple French fries. They're That's delicious. Right. John, John coming to a local bar near yeah. you, and he will chop your lemons and limes for you absolutely free. Johnny, great job as hey, always. Thank pleasure. you, my friend. Appreciate that. $29.95, uh, free shipping and handling, as John said, too. Yep. Three flex today, so less than $10 to get it home. Hey, coming up in just a bit. One of my favorite items we have here is the origami for uh, your kitchen cart because not only do we have a great kitchen cart that we can do our prep work on top of or store things on, we've got built-in storage underneath. What are you kidding me? Four drawers? Shut up, that is amazing. And look at the price, it's only $109.95 today. If you've never had origami, you need to try it. That's coming up a little bit later. Stick around, we got a great storage solution coming your way next. Marlo Smith's 20 year anniversary and we're celebrating with special anniversary pricing and exclusive anniversary items. Join us as we walk down memory lane with Marlo from over two decades. Plus, check out her hand-picked favorite items from Moncombe, Smith & Cult, and many more. Pop the champagne and show Marlo some love. The celebration begins Sunday at 5 p.m. or search Marlo Smith at hsn.com to shop all her favorites. Italy, a land known for luxury, heritage, and style, comes Perlier. Exquisitely crafted, natural ingredients, where tradition meets modern science. The ultimate spa experience. No appointment necessary. Shop Perlier Monday. everybody so we are organizing you and getting you uh, fully uh, prepared and ready to go in your kitchen 
And of course, storage is huge, okay? I have a very small house, only about 15, 1600 square feet, and I have a small kitchen in there, so I don't have a lot of storage. The storage I do have, I need to take advantage of, and that's what you can do with our brand new, this is a, an amazing company called Progressive. This is called Snaplock. This is a 20-piece storage set for a price that's ridiculous at only $39.95. These are gonna last you years and years and years and years. They're easy on the hands, and it is a huge set with a huge variety of containers. This is the brand new HSN launch. It is our showstopper, and I'm telling you, it's gonna keep your food and leftovers fresh. It's gonna keep them organized. I love the built-in silicone seals, mm -hmm. which keeps the water out and the buggies out in the air, out of there as well. They stack easily. They're great in a cabinet, in your fridge, freezer, microwave, safe. And uh, you are going to absolutely love it. If you, um, if you buy these today, call us. T tell us what you need them for, what you're going to use them for, because I'd love to hear it. The lovely Kelly Diedrich is Hi, here, I'm my buddy. I'm super excited about these. I, this is, this is they, like, the, You'll never lose your lid. They're so well made. They're so high quality. Yeah. It has a hinged lid. So all you do is snap that on never and go. Never seen that before. So if you've ever had the ones that have the lids attached to them, yeah. the hinges are always breaking off. And then they're useless. Ours are completely hinged. So all you have to do is you see you just snap on the hinge and then close it. It's hard to do backwards and upside down. And then give it a close and lock it into place as guys doing yeah so by the way bpa free dishwasher safe microwave safe and then you just give it a little snap you hear that snap that's freshness locking in but you'll never lose your lid because when you store them you can store them with the lid attached so what's so cool is that lid comes completely off and then you can also store it locked into place I gotta get these. and let's talk about all the different pieces that yeah, you're yeah, getting yeah. can we walk over do you guys mind if we walk over there all yes right. okay, i already got over. permission you all know right, i'm yeah, a rule follower let's do it I the rule follower. Okay, all right. so you have your choice of colors, which is amazing. Do I get all these you, big containers. Yeah, so you're actually getting you three of the two cups. You're getting three of the four cups. Then you're getting two eight cups and two 12 cups. So you're getting all the way from the smallest to the very largest, and you have your choice of colors. And remember, the lids all snap so oh. that you know it's locked. Oh. <laughs> I caught it. <laughs> they're BPA free, they're freezer safe, dishwasher safe, and you're never gonna lose your lids again. So if you're somebody that's ever gone into your food storage cabinet and you cannot find the lid, these stay stuff. attached. So look at how it stays attached. Yeah. And then if you want to peel off the back, all you do is you pop take off the hinges. Okay. So it's easy cleaning. And by the way, our little silicone gasket, that's what keeps it leak proof. That's removable too, you guys. So if you get any food particles, they're easy, easy to clean. So Progressive has been around 44 years. They've been innovating. Their name yeah. is Progressive. They really, truly think about the future of food storage. So they're constantly coming up with solutions to problems. And they noticed that the snap-on containers, they're out there. But the biggest problem with those is that they're constantly breaking. Yeah. So they've now given us that removable hinge that snaps into place when you want it to right. and snaps out of place when you want it to. I so you it. can keep it on there as well. So it's always with its, it's always it's with always its. With its mates. With its mates. So you Absolutely. never have to worry about losing them. I love, Kelly, one of my favorite things, I love the sizes that we have because, you know, more often than not, I'm looking, I love this, the big size, and we get four of those because, you know, whether it's leftover lasagna or you're yep. doing, uh, you know, pasta salads, things that take up a lot of room, um, you know, if you're doing a, a stuff there for parties and things like that, yeah. you can put a lot of stuff inside the big containers. Now, a lot of people are asking, Isn't that is, crazy? These are brand new. Are they going to be waterproof? Yes. Tight? That's soup. Okay. You can throw your salsa, your marinara sauce. Sauces. You can throw this in your expensive briefcase. Ladies, your expensive handbag. Go ahead and throw your soup. You would never do that until now. So not only are we talking easy to open, easy to close snaps, not only are we talking the fact that all of the lids snap their hinges, snap into place. You can yeah. see the hinges are back here. That's not going to break away. So all you have to do, and you can hear it. I'm going to take it up to my microphone. That's freshness, that snap locking into place. So all that silicone keeps it water watertight. They're easy to use, plus you're getting a variety of sizes. Love the different colors that you're getting as well. All right, um, we have different colors available for you. Saw the green, comes in the gray, comes in the blue, and comes in the purple as well. Um, the, uh, what I also like about these is the snaps are larger, yep. so they're a little bit easier on your yeah, hands. True. Some of the little ones are, are, you know, that you see in the stores, which, let's be honest, most of those are throwaway. These are not, these are not disposable. You're gonna have these for years. Yeah, and you can All throw right? them in your, like you can see, Top Rack dishwasher, you can throw them in the freezer, you can throw them in the microwave, they're BPA-free. I also wanna talk about it as more of like a permanent storage solution. Sure. So, 
the average family throws away $2,800 worth of food. So we know that these are perfect for your leftovers. But how about your dry goods, your pastas, your rice, your quinoa, your peppercorns, your spice rack, sure. your spice cabinet. What about Go nuts? Ahead you know, nuts and, and peanuts and nuts things like that. and potato chips yeah. and popcorn. You actually can hear it locking into place. And then look how easy it is to open and close. And when you open it, you actually feel a little resistance from that seal. So when you right. feel just a tad bit, so you'll actually hear the air leaking back in and you'll feel the air leaving and then you, he you can actually hear that locking mechanism which keeps everything safely locked into place and then you snap it open and there you go. So when you open it, you see, you can actually feel that resistance and that's what that airtight, watertight seal is doing. I yes. mean, that's really working for you. As you use them more and more, you'll begin to love all the different features that this has that maybe other food storage didn't have. Because oftentimes you'll get good food storage that's maybe leak proof, but then you're losing the lids. Right. You can't ever find the lid to the mate. It all stacks nicely, so it's very modular. If you're somebody that loves to be organized sure. for your crafting, this is just baked goods or dry goods. You can see we have our beans on the inside of this one. If you want to do your lentils, you're getting a 20-piece set. Therefore, you can use it as you choose. I mean, you know what you need to store. You know that you're yeah. sick and tired of throwing food away. And, and by the way, they all have the rectangular design, which they did that for a reason, because when you put things on shelves and in refrigerators, it's angled, <laughs> you yep. know, round stuff doesn't really fit in there that well. And you can put anything you can put in a round thing, you can put in a rectangular yep. thing, so it gives you lots of space. So whether it's your dry beans, we've got lentils over there, or, or, or uh, a kidney beans, and or whatever it is, soup again. or leftovers. Think about your leftovers. The key, you know what really kills leftovers? Things like rice and stuff like that? Yeah. Air. Or, yeah. That's your air, because, you know, little rice granules will get kind of crunchy and nasty. You want to keep the air out, you want to keep the liquid or out. Or the bugs. Or the bugs, Have right? you ever had the pantry bugs? If you've oh, ever had the pantry pasta. bugs. You know What's, what's here, and, and you'll understand this. What's unfortunate when you go to a lot of the health food stores yes. is that you'll see sometimes you get the little mealy bugs yep. in the pasta because they don't use any kind of preservative, yes, is sir. A, which is a good and a bad. You know, maybe a little extra protein doesn't bother you, but I don't want to see things crawling No, that kind of protein, I'm, I'm not yeah, good with. I don't need not bugs. the bug kind of protein. So this is going to help to keep the buggies from maybe jumping from point A to point B. Yes, which absolutely. Which is good, too. So, in fact, it's a good idea to take your pasta out of the box anyway. Take your pasta out of the box because that's not protecting it. I love this idea, too. You can serve directly from it. So when you unsnap that hinge, oh, you can actually place like your... A picnic. Yeah, yeah, this is your little picnic. So whether you have your fruit salad, you have your chips and salsa. By the way, check the salsa out. You guys, that's very rare that you find not only leak proof where you can throw your liquids around, but with the silicone and the snap so that you don't lose a lid. Number one and two problems with this type of food storage is A, that hinge is always breaking, so therefore it renders it useless. You right. can't even get the lid shut. And B, you have you're always losing the lid. This solves all those problems because you're yeah. not going to lose the lid and you have this silicone and, which is keeping everything fresh. And this is really important. I don't know how close you can get to the lip of this container, but, um, and I'll turn it a little bit. This is a very thick lipped container. Yep. Now, why do they do that? Because this is a stress point where they always crack on the cheap ones. Good. And that also doesn't, it, it, you can't you can't put a substantial lid on something that's cheap. This is so heavy duty. That's why we have big Great snaps shots. on there. You hear how it snaps? You hear all three this lock is, into place. This is as close to glass without being having the weight. Yeah, absolutely. Right? And by the way, it's totally BPA free. So if you're somebody that uses glass so you because you're worried, you can microwave it. I just yeah. pulled that soup right out of the microwave wave. You could steam your corn. This is our little picnic situation, but I'm going to take this right up to my microphone because I want you to actually hear it snapping. Yeah. So now you're not, uh, you're not wondering, well, is it closed? Is it not closed? So there's our picnic. Feel free to take it in a cute little picnic basket. Leave this in your picnic basket at all times. It's a permanent storage solution, not just a solution for your leftovers. Of course, it's going to do your leftovers such a, 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 a service because you're not going to be throwing them in the garbage, but this is yeah. the 12th core. Uh, 12 cups, excuse oh, me. Oh, a great idea Look for sandwiches, sandwiches to go, right? And they're Three perfect. Three full-size sandwiches. Now, imagine throwing this into a cooler with ice that melts. Yep. It won't matter. The ice will not get your sandwiches uh, liquidy. Nobody and wants then soggy sandwiches. The, I don't want a soggy no. sandwich. And then we have all of our cutlery. So there's your little picnic situation. By imagine way, sending this to somebody that's going off to yeah. college for so a dorm room or an apartment. For snacks or for bringing uh, stuff to lunch or stuff to, or for lunch to work. And again, here, I want you to see. Now, when I close this lid, I want you to look inside first of all.
of all, you see how much silicone is here. I can actually stick my finger. I can go actually get down in there like a quarter of an inch, right? And that, when that hits this lip, and the lip is very, it's a very sharp lip right here, it basically, that's what creates that cushion of air. See right there? When you close that, see how it goes down? And it recesses into the silicone, and then you lock it, and that's all you need to do. And now this thing, you're not going anywhere. I mean, this is, this is, this is it. Open it up, everything is fresh, and you don't lose the lid because the lid is attached to the tin. Where'd you go, Kelly? I'm over here, my friend. I'm right. over at our, uh, at our refrigerator because right. these are all square. We do not like round food storage containers because nobody has a round refrigerator, yeah. am I correct? So everything's square, so you can see everything scoots back into a corner. So you're utilizing all the space as best as possible. Anytime you see a round food storage set, you might sort of, you know, an alarm might go off in your head, like, well, that doesn't make sense because I don't have any round space in my refrigerator. Right. So here's your herbs. By the way, herbs go bad the moment we blink. Now you can store them completely watertight, airtight with that silicone seal, and now they'll last longer. You know what else? I was just the guy looked at the eggs that you have up in there. You know what I would do? You could take your eggs, and you could put eggs in one of these containers, like a dozen eggs in that oh, larger container. Great idea. And they'll be a lot safer than oh. in the carton they come yes, in. Yes, if, if things thrown around yes. in your fridge, they well, won't be breaking. Right. Absolutely. Yeah, they take up the, like we said they, they the amount of space they take up is actually lower profile than a carton of eggs yep. and because the eggs will lay down on their side so I mean it really you can't you can't go wrong with these things and they're built industrial uh, tough so they're gonna last a long long time um, you know if you are continuing to buy those five and six packs of the throwaways that's a waste. First of all, you know, you can't, they, you know, if you're not recycling them, they, they, they don't last, they, yeah. they fall apart. Or if you're um, sick and tired of losing yeah, your lid. They're not real containers. I mean, they're, 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 they're meant to be one-use containers. These are meant to last a dozen years or more. I mean, you'll be passing these down. Don't let people wander off your house with these, okay? Because these are the highest quality that you're going to find. They're BPA-free, freezer safe, dishwasher safe, and you have the silicone totally keeping it leak-proof, and you have the locking mechanism, and you have the hinge which come completely off. If you want to completely remove those, they're not going to snap and break. So you can remove them for easy cleaning and you can remove them for easy uh, serving as well. And if you want to store them, they all store nicely within each other. They all nest nicely. Right. So don't worry about that. But if I were you, I would always leave the lid on them because that's the point of this type of food storage. Say, yeah, I don't know why I would take it off because yeah. I'm not going to, this I'm not going to be using like when they're not full. Right. Like I will probably, I could go you, home. They're always going to have something in there. <laughs> I could go your garage, your I could your use crafting. every one of those in my refrigerator right now. Oh, probably I could Easily. too. Absolutely. So lettuce, things, vegetables, fruits, meat. Sugar. Even like, what about cold cuts? You know what I bought the other day? Coffee. I bought, I bought a really good prosciutto, uh -huh. which they sell in the deli, yep. that has the tear open plastic that oh, doesn't, yeah, yeah, you, then you what are you going to do with it? it? That's absolutely right. You could put right. that in there too. You could put it right back in here. By the way, you're getting 20 pieces. So That's what awesome. a great deal where you're never going to lose the lid. So if you've ever experienced that frustration, I know my mom has the other day she came home and she goes I threw away seven food storage things that didn't have a lid seven lids she's lost I don't know where lids go they go where the socks go I think yeah, but seven of them went bye-bye in the time that she was able to find these and all of her lids are going to remain attached all right 20 pieces we got to move on because I know you have more you have yes. those cool don't you have the cool shears, coming, the cool up next shears coming up all right but but grab these while you can listen if you want a storage solution that's going to last you for years instead of weeks like the cheapo ones, I think you should go with this. And also, uh, if you got leftovers and things you want to extend the, uh, the shelf life of your food, this is yep. the way to go, too. All right, Kelly's not going anywhere because she's got a two-pack of the coolest, basically, uh, kitchen shears. Utility garden shears. shears. ever. Um, before we do that, if you would like to check out some of the other cool stuff that we have on hsn.com in the world of origami, this is our, four, our folding two-drawer pantry rack. Uh, one of my favorite items because I like the shape of it. It doesn't take up a lot of space, so it easily rolls in and out of a pantry. You got lots of racks, lots of places to put your stuff. Um, and you can yeah, pick that, or if you're looking for heavy duty, we got heavy duty racks in there as well. Look how it folds up for storage. Although, I, I don't think anybody really stores them, they just use them. I guess when you move and you wanna pick it up, take it up and, and, and move it, you can do that as well. Um, anyway, 521575 if you wanna pick that up. All right, so you know, Realistically, and I learned this many, many years ago, you know, your parents teach you there's a tool for every job, yes. right? Um, and then you uh, work like I did in the restaurant business for about 18 years, and you realize that it's so important to have really good tools in the yes. kitchen. Most of us can be hacks, and we just kind of use what we have, and we'll use the wrong scissors. You know, we'll use paper scissors to try to cut, uh, you know, chives and things like that. Don't do which it. you really shouldn't do. We've got, and we love this company, Dash. Uh, yep. they, they simplify 
your life? Is that what it is? Unprocess your food. Your they food. also simplify, simplify your, your life. life. They I do was, all yeah. of those things. All right. We're going to give you a two pack of these amazing utility shears. It's only $17.95. They are super tough and durable. This is an exclusive launch for us with these two sets of shears. And these are going to work on the toughest cutting jobs you have absolutely no problem. We're going to give you two. Figure maybe you want one for the kitchen. Yes. Maybe you want one for the garden. Yep. Crafting room, scissors, utility. Crafting. Yep. Yeah. So I love these because I don't love to slice. So there's very there's a very rare occasion that you will see me on television using a knife. I'm not great at it. We always reserve those shows for John Florell or Mark Gill. But I am really good at using utility shears, okay? Yeah. Because these are basically kitchen scissors. But this is medical grade surgical steel. So these will never rust. They also have a locking mechanism so that it's safe to go right in your utility drawer. And then the moment you squeeze it, it opens up. This little spring hinge here takes up to 60% of the strength and you utilizes it so that you don't have to use wrist strength or arm strength. So imagine using a pair of scissors. You're using about 100% of your strength. This right. takes away about 60% of that. If you're doing a salad, go ahead, ditch the knife for a moment, and you can actually use utility shears to do a beautiful mm -hmm. salad. You can see it's so much faster than getting out a cutting board and a knife. Um, I'm always slicing up my peppers this way, so give them a little rinse under water. Take them and give them a beautiful slice that way, and you can see how pretty everything comes out. These are dishwasher safe and these are going to be great for the garage as well. Oh I want to go yeah. into the garage yep. as well. Stainless steel and this super comfortable grip. So yep. if you have any issues with your hands and I know a lot of people that have issues with their hands and they can't even hold a knife any yep. longer, but they can still have a little bit of a grip. They can still shake your hand. If yep. you can hold somebody's hand, you can use these shears. That's how so simple easy it is. to pull. Give them a little clip. Um, they give you a little assist with the spring, um, which helps to pop them open, which keeps you from having to put your fingers in to scissors, which yeah. can be really uncomfortable. It is, and scissors don't have that type of strength. You have to use your whole hand strength, your whole arm strength yeah. to really get into anything. Yeah. And most kitchen shears are not food, you know, medical grade surgical steel, so they rust. That's the problem. They stick together, they rust. Medical grade surgical steel, you can see how sharp and how durable. It has that locking mechanism. But I want to go and talk about the garage. Let's move. We're going to kind of jump a little bit. Okay, we'll Because it, it'll actually go through, you know, wire. It's awesome for crafting. So obviously this is pipe cleaner. Go straight through wire. You can see the mm -hmm. wire on the end there. This will go through tin. This will cut, you know, picture wire. Um, here's our ribbon, which is cutting directly through wire. So you're going to use this in the garage. You're going to use this in the kitchen. You're going to use this when you're crafting. This is a cool example. Oh, God. <laughs> dropping Your everything. Watch out for that. I'm dropping everything. That's uh, my fault because I put all my stuff over here. I like this one. Uh, this is a tin sign. I mean, I'm just giving you an example. Right through tin, you yeah. guys. That is the type of strength that's the type of sharpness that we're talking about right. uh, I've got tin flying around the studio you can even do like you know so anybody that you know does a lot of work out in the garage maybe you're crafting I tried this earlier I said there's no way it'll go through this book it went right through every single page of that book I mean you can see all the way through the end there I mean that's the type of strength that we're dealing with with these utility you shears you don't come to my house and cut my books <laughs> I, I, I know. Oh, I'm gonna say, <laughs> I hate that book <laughs> hey listen and, and of course the one obvious thing we haven't even talked about that is if you're going to use this for seafood and you know because I and I love you know we here in Florida Ooh, go ahead. We, get into the lobster we have, for me we have crab meat and things like that and and, uh, and lobster and you know and you if you can look at you go right down the middle I mean that's one that's one shot. Dude. Yeah, one shot. So it just makes life so much easier. How easy and is that? if you want, you get you get two different colors. So you can actually take one and leave it in the kitchen and then take the white pair and leave it in the garage, leave yeah. it in your crafting room, wherever you want to leave it. You can see these are our silk flowers. One little snip went right through that thick silk flower and right through that wire. So the sky's the limit in terms of what you're gonna be able to use these for. This is some more, I think this is like electrical wire. This will go through picture hanging wire. It'll really go through anything in the garage, you know, unless it's something that needs a chainsaw. Um, you can see a lot of things are held together with zip ties right through your zip tie, my friend. No issues there. Here's a different copper type of wire. So whatever it is that you're doing all the way through the thickest ropes as well, scissors would have a difficult time sort of going through that rope too. So I love being able to use one in your craft room and your utility closet well, yeah. in your garage and then use one in the kitchen all the time. Get out the, the knife. Less. We're gonna give you we're gonna give you two, okay? So you 
you show, you get, if you order the turquoise, this is how you order. You order a turquoise, you get a turquoise and a white. If you order red, you're going to get a red and a white. So I love that you get, this is two for $17.95. It's crazy. That is ridiculous. And by the way, I have a feeling the turquoise is going to outsell the red. That's a really great, it's a really great color it's that you don't color. see very often. But what's nice is you can use one, even if you want to use one, uh, you know, like I said, in the kitchen and then use one as a crafting thing yep. or, or use one as your garden shears. You know, gardeners love this. Or flowers. Because when they're cutting, you know, when you're cutting uh, fruits and vegetables off yep. the vine, it, you know, it's better not to rip them You're off. Not it's better to cut to. them. Yeah, you can yeah. actually use these as gardening shears. So if you are utilizing, your herbs. yeah, for your herbs. But this is, you know, right through, no problems whatsoever. Going right through, you know, your fresh cut flowers, your silk flowers for a beautiful flower arrangement. So if you are somebody that wants to arrange your beautiful flowers, you can utilize them that way. Here's how I utilize mine. I'm gonna grab a new pair since I just did uh, flowers. For my son, he's three, so I will cut into his sandwiches and make them really fun shapes, you know? So here's just a, a regular old peanut butter sandwich. Rather than having to slice that and get it all squishy, I'll go ahead and cut little triangles for him. And then, of course, I know he's three, but I still always cut his grapes in half. I'm always worried about choking hazard there. So I use my, these to slice When he's 17, you might want to stop doing it. No, no, I'm gonna be slicing Maybe, his grapes uh, in half at 17. Stop slicing his grapes don't, in don't half. Don't tell me how to parent. Oh my lord. <laughs> All right, anyway. Your cheese, your charcuterie. I just gave Danny his own knife when he was like, full. go ahead, cut it up, kid. Have it's a good time. A, hey, that's that a joke. Does not surprise All right, me. so if you want to put, now here's another thing too, if you want to do fresh herbs, you know, sometimes it's hard for people to roll up and yep. do a little chiffonade of basil and sure. things like that. So you can use the scissors and you can go right into whatever it is you want to use, whether it's fresh sauce and you're just, you know, because things like basil and herbs really need to. And look at the nice, beautiful slice that you're getting. You, you know. You, you don't have you, to get out a big knife. You don't have to be a chef to do all of these things. No, it's very easy. And you know, when you, right when, you your cut, when you cut herbs like that, it releases that great, um, a great flavor too. Even things like bread, like a pita. You know, a pita is hard to cut. Yeah, Look crab at this, legs. Man. King oh, crab you legs, my me? friend. Look at this. I'm making those little pita chips. I'm not even trying that hard. Well, I was gonna make it a little bit prettier for our little, our little hummus I'm just tray fun. up front. But it makes life easier. So well, rather you're than getting out, half of your kids. So I'm just, I'm <laughs> like, I just would wing this thing at Danny from across the room. Hey, I have a pita. <laughs> Woo! By You'd the way, you guys, thing. totally nice rust proof out. because this is medical grade surgical steel. It's not gonna rust. It has that nice, nice safety locking mechanism so you can actually lock it into place. And then that spring there, that takes all of the pressure out of the wrist so that it just pops open and closed. Do you cut his spaghetti up for him? Oh, that's a great oh, one actually. Oh, the humanity. To cut your spaghetti. She's cutting up the spaghetti. Or your zucchini noodles he's when got, they come out of the spiral your, slicer. Your child has teeth, He's right? only three. Yeah, but he's got big choppers already. <laughs> you don't have to chop up his pasta. He's he like, told me to smack you. You're ruining his whole slurp thing with the pasta anyway. You're the best. Thank you. Uh, anyway, we're not going anywhere because we got origami coming up. Here, eat some peanut butter. <laughs> oh, that's delicious. You punk. Now I can't talk. <laughs> All right, it's back to school, which means free shipping and flex pay and special pricing. It's hard to say peas when you have peanut butter in your mouth. That was the point. All right, so anyway, uh, select back to school stuff featuring home office. All you do, see that little icon at the bottom says back to school? Click on that guy, and that'll get you where you need to go. Dude, I'm like, I'm like, we used to put peanut butter on my dog's tongue. Hilarious. I got that now. Stick around, we got more. <laughs> There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. Flex pay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN.
you've been shopping at HSN for like the last few years and you don't have origami by now, well, you're crazy. You gotta try some of this stuff. I know every single person that works here at one point in their life gets some origami. Uh, and what it is, is it's these wonderful folding, incredible storage solutions for us that we have here at HSN. If you look at the top of where the item number over there is, look at the yellow stars and notice every one and the last one are almost completely covered in yellow. That is because this is almost, it's like 90% five-star reviews. Everybody loves this. If you own it, there's our phone number at the bottom of the screen. This is the four-core kitchen, our four-drawer kitchen cart. Uh, this one comes with that built-in wooden shelf. Without a doubt, uh, probably my top three origamis, this is in there somewhere. Uh, my regular kitchen cart, this, and then I like the pantry one. But this one to me is the best kind of combined, best of both worlds. Because you have storage built in and you have a cutting board mm -hmm. and a, at a prep table on top. And as uh, Tracy Rosa, who is here. Hello. Who is the lovely Tracy Rosa who's here, will tell us this is just a great way to store stuff. Oh, mm. it's, it's like check, 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 you know. Right and across the board. Across the board. And yeah. here's the other thing. I know you talked about the cutting board, you talked about the storage, you talked about the powder coated steel. Let me talk about the fact that it's zero assembly. <laughs> the fact that you don't have to put it together. Right. There are no tools, there are no instructions, there's no manual, there's no labor. You literally take it out of the box like this. So it's gonna come, all of these drawers nest. So it's really like getting one drawer. But you take it out of the box and it's flat packed, okay? You open it up, there you go. There's, there's not even a clasp or anything. You put the top on. There you go. And then there are little pegs and little holes right here. Yeah. You marry those down. Boom. Now the entire system is in place. Here's the other cool thing about these drawers. They're all the same size. There are no tracks. Right. There are no wheels. There's nothing you have to worry about. Boom. All of them fit in each one. They come all the way out. So if you have this full of stuff and you want to move it about the house to, you know, work on a project, you can do that. But look at how easy it slides in and out. Perfect. I'm not lining up any wheels. I'm not lining up any tracks. No problem there. And then they all go into place. Now, let's talk about these drawers for a second because these are mighty. These are powder coated steel. These are super, super strong. They're extremely deep. And each one holds 15 pounds worth of weight in each one of these drawers. And when you pack it in with the 15 pounds, it still slides nicely in and that. out. You don't have to worry about it. There There's you go. no wheelies or little weird oh. things you have to line up. It's one long track and, and, and all it does is it slides in. Metal and metal makes it easy yep. for you. I love the fact that we have a lot of storage here. So think about it. You could wheel this in and out of a pantry very easy yeah. because it does come on wheels mm -hmm. or, or it does come with wheels so you could patch those that's really the only thing you install it takes about five seconds to pop the wheels in um, and and then you can uh, move it wherever you want you could put it into a, a separate um, little walk-in pantry yeah, absolutely. you can keep it out you know what I love about this one too is that I also like our kitchen one uh, is that I've got a surface area that I can also work with. exactly yeah. exactly and then I want to get a top shot oh perfect because I want you to see how absolutely gorgeous this wood is you know this is that furniture grade wood through and through through beautiful grains no two are going to be the same because it is that quality wood but look at how gorgeous it is with that beautiful pop of red right there and like you said it's a good work surface I mean this this top shelf guy holds 50 pounds worth of weight yeah. so this is great for your mixers this is great for your appliances for your heavy pressure cookers any of those big appliances that you want to clear up off the countertop and now you have a space to do it yeah and, and as we said too you know when, when holiday season comes up yeah. and you're doing even little display things mm -hmm. you know maybe you want to uh you know you want to put a little christmas tree on here and set up put your christmas cookies around it wheel them out maybe you want to use it at thanksgiving and you want to put your turkey on here which oh, yeah. you can right if you as long as you have a turkey that's not over 50 pounds you're going to be okay and if you do have a turkey that's over 50 pounds i'd like to come over and see right that right my pound number turkey. is <laughs> exactly but anyway uh you can use it for serving uh at parties you can make it into a little wine table mm -hmm. i know tracy's got lots of great ideas for how you can use it we'd love to hear from you if you have great ideas on how to use it but i think the real thing here tracy is the response that we get from the people that buy it. Absolutely. Um, you know, when we, we have our customer reviews on there and we try to please as many people as we possibly can. You can't make everybody happy all the time. Mm -hmm. But what I love about this is it's one of those things that really struck a chord with our, with our customer mm -hmm. because our customer's like, you know what? Yeah, you know what? I, I don't live in a 10,000 square foot house. I don't have 15 different storage closets. I need to enjoy my house and the storage that I have, but I could use a little help. That's what this is. And whether you use it as, we have people that use them as barbecue carts, whatever. Yeah. 
It gives you an extra opportunity to put stuff there where you don't have to put it in a regular kitchen cabinet. It's great on things that you use regularly too. Absolutely. Right? And once you get this home, I, I really can't you know, tell you enough about the capacity that you're getting with each one of these drawers because it'll hold a lot of stuff. I mean, just right here, these are canned goods. You know, you've got yeah. your jellies, you've got your pastas, you've got, and it still slides in and out so nicely. We have all the colors. This is our vintage bronze. So you saw the red, the number one accent color in kitchen vintage bronze we've got the beautiful white right here we have black and we have silver so these are all of our colors so we're right. lucky to have those in but I mean this is what I'm talking about look at your countertops right now take a second and just think of the stuff that's taking up all that valuable real, real estate do you have a microwave on the countertop do you have a mixer do you have a big bowl of fruit you know now you can get those countertops back and now you have a storage solution and a one that's a perfect footprint it just is under four feet tall so it will fit underneath you know th my daughter actually has this in her um bedroom because it hangs it's right underneath those hanging shirts sure. and so now she has a complete drawer system in there um so again look at this is this is a full-size microwave fits perfectly i've got big pastas down here you can put um you know you put your pots and pans and you can put stuff in here that's a little damp because it is that powder coated steel sure. so again again capacity 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 I mean, look at the amount of apples that we have right here, and it's not even full. No. You know, I mean, it's Tracy's fruit store right there. Yeah, right. Is what it is. Yes. So if you, if you're somebody who loves to go to the farmers market, sure. are you, and you love to buy up all the fresh fruits and vegetables, you can put them now in here. It's aerated, so it's staying fresher That's the longer. That's key, right? So it breathes. Yeah. yeah. So you're not going to get that rotten stuff spreading into the rest of look your at, fruit. This takes up what a quarter of this bin, and look at the amount of, of stuff that you're yeah. getting with this. You know. And that simply just as if you, you know, for for fresh stuff, if you are doing um, dry goods, look what Tracy did here. So everything that she could possibly want to, you know make cookies or mm -hmm. decorate or just have snacks for the kids down below she's got sugar and, and uh, flour and stuff like that so you can put those canisters right yeah. in there right anything that you can uh, store that's dry goods would go in here even like you know what I love you did one of those big cast iron pans at the bottom yep. that shows you two things one the size also the weight capacity this holds. And, and look at the amount of space that you still have I mean, sure this is a, a ve this is very heavy yeah. <laughs> um, pan right here and then you still can put your utensils or put small you put another toaster right here I mean but uh, we call it the kitchen cart, and I get that, you know, because we're showing it in, in, for kitchen ideas. But think of your office. Think of being yeah. able to put all of your, you know, like a charging station. You could put a laptop yeah. on top here. Can you imagine here. if you were a crafter, right? Yes. And you, what, what's that, what are those things they use in crafting? The, Cricket, the cricket sewing machine, whatever yeah. you got, yeah. right at your fingertips. And then all your crafting supplies yes. can go underneath. Um, this could be a laundry cart for you very Absolutely. easily because with the extra large drawers, you could put towels, you could put, um, you know, uh, whatever soap, uh, laundry mm -hmm. soap in there. Whatever you need to put in there, you can fit it. And remember, you don't have to use all the drawers at once. <clears throat> you know, if you take a couple out and you want to just lighten it up you're only using a couple that's fine look at this just just extra stuff like little bonies for the dog right well look at it. where would that stuff normally end up the leash the treats the, oh, no. uh, the everything you know lost. and now it has it's lost it's all lost. gone yeah. Lido can't go for a walk that's what happens <laughs> but uh, you know what it's funny because that happens when you look for the leash you can never find it yeah things like uh, uh, backup rolls of tape you know the, i could never find the tape and there's like uh, the little i have one of those little um those little um, like weed eater things and uh -huh. a little extra cord. I can never remember where I hide the little spools. Well, you, so you can put the stuff that, or even like I have jars of batteries like for recycled yeah. stuff that I keep. So you can keep your recyclable stuff in there. This could be a recyclable cart. You could put water bottles on one thing. Perfect. You could put glass on the other mm -hmm. and then just dump it in the bin at the end of the week. Well, we are, you know, around the holiday, well, summertime, we had a ton of family come and visit, you know, and usually we don't have enough bedrooms for all that. We don't have a guest room. So the kids get the boot out of their room, you know, for right. the company to come in. What but, about the tent? Huh? That's fine. Yeah, they get out and go outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But here's the deal. I, now, with this, I don't have to move out their closets. I don't have to empty out their drawers. I can literally pull this in and then now my guests have a, a shelving system that they can unpack. I can put their fresh linens on top here. I can put their towels, whatever they need. And then they have a, a drawer system right here. Any place that you need extra storage space, this is the answer. If you are out buying furniture for, um, for college dorms right now, I mean, think of what you're paying and think of what you're buying. You're buying sure. a lot of times particle board. You're buying plastic. You're you're not going to be able to bring that back home. It's not going to be able to go from year to year. This is. This is powder coated steel. And I've stacked these like this because I want you to understand the capacity that you're getting with them. They all do nest like this. So if you if you need to break it down, it's literally storing one drawer. And then again, guy, this is your assembly. 
You know? Yeah, I know. That's the best part. I mean, there. <clears throat> Comes in, yeah, you that's get out of the box. <laughs> you open the box, and that's what's in there, yeah. right? Just like that. The only thing is the wheels aren't in there, right? right? And then the, the, the I think the, the drawers, I think, are stacked separately. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and you're good to go. Yeah. And that's it. And you get it home, and you don't have to fiddle with nothing. Listen, the price break is great today. These are $20 off. But you got to remember to ship this. Does that say $18.95 to wow. ship? I think it does. So that's $38.95 that, that you're going to take off the price today. You're going to love this thing. I'm telling you, you're going to use it throughout the year, even if you just use it as your little portable cart mm -hmm. for your kitchen cart. Like I said, you can put a couple slabs of rib on, or ribs on this and you put your sauce and your, and your towels and you can take it out to the barbecue. Yep. You can uh, put, a, put a nice uh, tablecloth on top of it and then uh, bring it over to the oven and pull the turkey out and let mm -hmm. the turkey rest. Like, I, you know, t turkey's so much easier when it's not on your table because it takes up so much dang oh, yeah. room. Well, we always talk about this because yeah. I, I, when the holidays come, I really try and do it nice. I try I and have all the beautiful place settings and the right. fancy crystal and all that but then time comes there's no room for the food hey you know what you could do <laughs> right and you know what you could do too right here. maybe you got one of those yeah. uh, maybe you got one of our big slow cookers and you're using it during oh, yes. holiday for hors d'oeuvres you could actually because you could put a, a crock pot Absolutely. up here a pressure cooker up here you know on the, on the keep warm and put your little pigs in a blanket or buffalo wings or whatever you got a party at a f big football party you could put hors d'oeuvres on here Absolutely. and you can wheel them in and you can wheel them out mm -hmm. wherever you need this to be it'll be functional it can be uh, as we said like a little center thing in your kitchen for extra prep area maybe you know you tell the kids okay we're gonna make holiday cookies right. here's your table don't right. bother mom well and dad. everything is right there right you know everything is at your fingertips here's the other cool thing if you've ever shopped for a drawer system like this before a lot of times the drawers don't come out completely i love that so if i needed to take this entire drawer of spices or fruit or veg whatever i have in yeah. here and i want to take it over to the countertop and prep, I can. Or, if it, like you said, if this is my portable pantry, because listen, you can put cans in here, you can put um, jars, whatever you want, sure. and you can just wheel it right to where you're cooking. You I have know. extra prep space, now you have all your storage, now you're not taking five or six trips back to the pantry, yeah. everything's at your fingertips. Yeah, honestly, you know? so whether you use it for for uh, food or whether you use it for, as we said, yeah. uh, industrial stuff, and you're, and you're you know, heck, you, this could be, you could easily put this in a, in a garage or a workroom and you could fill it with nails yes. or tools or whatever you want to do. It's That's the thing about origami is that it folds, it, it's easy, it stores, but it's also anything uh -huh. you want it to be. Any and job you want it any for. Any job, and you know, I forget, think about the kids. Think about like a place for them to actually be able to put their toys. Sure. You know, I mean, we've had this before where we had, you know, those little, you know, the Legos that are like a million different pieces. Sure. You know, this, nothing's going to fall through because you've got that small, that fine mesh. So it holds everything in there. But again, these are full size jars, heavy, strong, and it still glides in and out. And yeah. that's one of the reviews that we get about these drawers because they move so you, easily. You probably have 60, 70, 80 pounds worth of At stuff least. on there and you At don't least. even have to worry about that. You know, when, when they designed origami, the, the, one of the big reasons they did it is because of the plastic shelving systems that were out there for people. Because I know mm -hmm. um, I used to, I had one in my storage shed that was made of plastic. It was awful. Um, it kind of got moldy and, it, and it, you know, it's affected by heat and temperature right. too because it's plastic. Um, and then I switched to origami and I love it. And those mm -hmm. are just the industrial racks. The kitchen racks, they've added a little bit of a, of a beautiful touch to it by painting them pretty colors, although right. they do most of them that now. But they also add these wooden tops, which just finish it off and make it just a, you know, you have industrial look, but mm -hmm. with a little bit of the homey touch on top. Well, think of this for your bathroom, because if you've ever put a hot curling iron on anything plastic, sure. yeah, that's not going to work out. I've done it once. No, it's bad. <laughs> it's bad. It's, it's going to melt through. But imagine how much stuff you can put in here. You can put all your lotions and your potions. You can put all your brushes, your curlers, your curling irons, your blow dryers, your straighteners. You can fold up nice towels and have a wonderful display right there. But if your drawers are full, so full that you can hardly even open them here is that solution and it's only about 18 by 18 inches all the way around so it's that perfect footprint yeah. and this is powder coated steel so if it is in the bathroom the steam the heat the humidity is not going to break this down it's not going to cause it to rust chip or corrode nothing like that but even in that picture i love that you can see the wood underneath there because it's quality that you're getting with this it's steel and it's wood and yeah. that, it's like a, it's an investment, it's a piece of furniture. You, you know? know, and when they when they put these together, they decide, that was the that was the plan. It's like, let's give them something that's gonna last 10, 15 years. Right. Let's not give them something that's just some cheapo system. Uh, you know, it's like when we had our, with the storage wear that we just had. You know, you can go out and you can spend 
a few bucks on something cheap right. at, at a home store. You can mm -hmm. do it very easily. Right. You can do that with solar lights or anything else. You can go buy cheap stuff, and then you wind up replacing it every year, all right? Mm -hmm. If you want something that's built to last, you need to go to things like origami because that's what it was designed for. By the way, it's as, it's easy to take apart and a breakdown. It's also easy to clean. If you need yeah. to, you know, another nice thing about the mesh drawers is if you want, you can just take them out of the sink and rinse them out or just <laughs> you take them outside and just dump them out right. and you know, tap it with the back of your hand and you can clean it out. Um, and because they breathe, you can store stuff in there that normally would would maybe turn bad if it was in a confined environment like fruits, I mean, like oh, yeah. potatoes and onions. You know, some people have just that, cold, whatever that sort of cellar for their for their root vegetables and things oh, like absolutely. that. absolutely. You can easily do that as well. We only have about one minute left. Um, here's why you want to buy it today. Uh, it's $20 off. There's another $18.95 off for um, for shipping and handling right there. You see, that's free. And then it's only $21.99, Tracy, to get it home on FlexPay today. So mm -hmm. if you've always wanted one, get it. If you read the reviews, and that's always my thing, go check out the reviews, read what people say about it. There was, let's say I took 464 people in this room and I asked who thinks it's perfect. 376 said perfect. And most of the rest said almost perfect for right. whatever reason. Maybe it wasn't tall enough, big enough, wide enough. I don't know. I don't, I don't bother with that stuff. Right. Uh, just the good people. <laughs> yeah. no. um, but anyway, the point is it's 4.7 stars. We only go up to five. So right. and you, you love it. You order it, you yeah. love it, you write about it. Um, if you're on the fence, take it from your friends and neighbors. Yeah. They're gonna love it too, so. Tracy. Of, it's definitely one of my favorites. It solves a very major problem in my life of trying to keep me organized. You're always organized. And again, belated happy birthday to you, my Thank dear. You. I was it's not away, belated. so we I didn't. celebrate get... all month. Huh? I said it's not I, belated, it we celebrate all month. It should be a birthday season, <laughs> is what it should be. All right, um, I saw the camera that was coming up down below and I saw this beautiful blonde. I believe it's Connie. It is Connie. Connie, baby, she's coming up next and she's got great stuff for you. I'll see you next week on HSN Today. Have a great day. Hi, everybody. Look who's back. Stacey Shefflin with YBF. She's been gone since.